Local News 8 in the morning continues. Welcome back. It is now 625 as promised. Our local critter, as Jeff likes to call it, we have uh, Pickles, right? Pickles, uh -huh. pickles the armadillo. That's right. And Shelby mm -hmm. Gold from the Idaho Falls Zoo uh, accompanying a Pickles. Morning, Shelby. Thanks for uh, morning. joining us this morning. Yeah, of course. So we had Pickles as a guest last year, and he didn't come out of his shell, but today he's not shy at all, it looks like. Yeah, he just takes a little while to get used <laughs> to his new surroundings, just like us if we're somewhere new. We're old friends. He was here last yeah. year, so that's good. <laughs> Okay, so remind me, how old is Pickles? So he was born in 2018, so turning five this year. Is that old for an armadillo? Or? Um, you know, in the wild, it's probably near the end of their lifespan just because they face more. But in captivity, it's anywhere from 10 to 15 years. Can you okay. turn him yeah. to the side so we can get a shot of him yeah, from the side? side? This side? Yeah, it doesn't matter. Just a profile shot oh, yeah. of the so pickle man. Go. He's yeah. coming out of his shell. There you go. And that shell is warm. He's mm -hmm. about the size of a cantaloupe. And those little hairs that are sticking out, does that help him find food? So that actually just traps the warmth inside of his carapace. Um, so if you guys see his nose, his nose is actually somewhat long. That's how he finds food and his claws that are out. You can see his little nose just yeah. like going so <laughs> like he crazy there. Yes, he uses his nose a lot. And so he likes to eat bugs. So he'll use mm. his nose to sniff them in the dirt or his claws to take off bark from trees and find them. Okay. Yeah, but he won't ruin yeah. the yard like some of the armadillos in the south and the no. west. Yeah, those things are just, they carry leprosy and are all sorts of mean and they'll dig things up. I've chased those <laughs> yeah. out of my yard before in Texas. Oh, now, no. <laughs> if you let him go, will he start scurrying around here? Because he will. Let, just let him go to see if okay. we can get him to. See if he'll move uh, around? Yeah, because yeah. uh, he's quite the little character. Now he's part of the outreach program for the Idaho Falls Zoo, IdahoFallsZoo.org. You have spring programs coming up. And what's the opening date for the zoo this year? April 12th. Okay. Here oh, we go. there we go. I, I think. Can I touch him? I, yeah. So oh, there you go. Gotta catch him first. Yeah. <laughs> there so he we'll, goes. We'll catch him if you touch him because these guys are actually very Look strong. Look at him ball up. That's how he protects oh, himself. Oh, there, there he, he goes. Take a shot there at. He like, goes. He's like a little medicine ball. Yeah. He's and all so up in if there. we have you touch him, we're going to touch him right here. Two fingers. Just because if he's scurrying around, he's very playful, um, but he doesn't realize how strong okay. he is. So what's yeah. the verdict? He came out of his shell. Put him back down there. Let's see if he, he uh, bolts back out again. And uh, I guess he's seeing his shadow. So what does that mean? <laughs> that means he's looking for a worm. Warm winter. <laughs> That's yeah. right. There oh, we go. there he goes. He's, he's not shy at all today. Hey, Pickles. Hi, Pickles. How you doing? He's a d armadillo dill Pickles. Yes. He's from the Idaho Falls Zoo. Thank you, Shelby. Yeah, thank for you getting so much, Shelby, and thank, thank you, Pickles. Pickles. When you have babies, they'll be called bread and butter. <laughs> 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 All right.